Well, today could be a questionable day. I mean, it's always going to be a good day, but it's been windy all night. It rained like crazily last night. Is that a word? Crazily? <laughs> there you go. I'm filming you hiding behind your coffee cup. These are the ones that Angie um, drew last night. So we have this guy with the fire hair. I think that's funny. <gasps> and then we have Snoopy. And Snoopy has his box of um, ornaments right there. So he's going to be working on his doghouse. That's why he's got the hammer and everything placed next to it. And yes, we have Woodstock. And Woodstock, you would think, would make nice little peep bird noises. But actually, Woodstock noises are really kind of harsh, aren't they? They kind of like go... <laughs> That's right, he does. Anyway, uh, one appointment today, and then we pick up Phoenix. Are you guys excited? Coda is so excited. Yeah. Coda? Are you super excited? Are you excited? Does it look like I'm excited? Should I be? <laughs> I'm always excited. All you have to do is say, Do you? And then I get so excited. Oh, uh, and uh, the mantis molted the other day. So we have the, the brown uh, mantis who is in the act of eating a cricket. Good. We were wondering if she was eating or not because she molted. That's her molt down there. She has beautiful wings like butterfly. Oh, God. And then over here we have this one here. So we have two mantis left. Both of them look to be female. Wah, wah, sad, sad. All right, I am off to my appointment for today, my job, and I picked the perfect time. Um, I set the appointment for 11 o'clock, and at 11 o'clock, there's 90% chance of rain. <laughs> After that, not so much. So, okay, got my stuff, got my stuff. Then after that, we're going to Lowe's because I broke a, uh, uh, not a drill bit, a, a saw blade last night. Um, but until then, I need to get going because I'm just about late. Hi, Phoenix. Can I jump in the wood? No, because you might slip and fall on your noggin. Ow. <laughs> Alright, let's go no see... No noggin! <laughs> no noggin. <laughs> okay. Let's go see Angie. Okay. And let's go do what you're supposed to do so that you get... Money. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? <laughs> what is that? Angie! <laughs> I love you. Oh, I love you. I missed you. Hey, oh, hey, hey, hey. So much. Get in here. Watch your toe. Move your toe. Wow. So Angie and I went and we got more stuff from storage today, so it's starting to look more like her house. <laughs> Alrighty. Wow, new table! Yeah, it's like every time you come here, there's something different happening, huh? Something changes. That is one big scrap heap. This is Woodstock. <laughs> Hellions, that right there is the end of the day. And it is windy and it is cold outside. Oh, dude, this wind is like chilling me to the bone. Anyway, so look at this. Look at the scrap. This is our scrap pile. And uh, this is Snoopy. I don't have to have Angie come here and complete Snoopy's neck because I don't know where to stop cutting there. But uh, yeah, so I'm going to cut Snoopy. I've got Snoopy tonight and then I also have Pigpen. I just got through doing or uh, cutting out uh, Woodstock and then the kid that had all the crazy hair. Oh my gosh. I'll show you here before the night's out. It was horrible. It, it took a while to do it. Anyway, my hand hurts. It's cold. I'm gonna get this done. And the wind. Stop the wind. Oh, there's Woodstock. And this right here is pig pen. And I was uh, getting pig pen cut. And all of a sudden, my blade broke. And it had, uh, the other one, I got two blades today. Both of them ended up breaking tonight. <sighs> so, didn't get as much done as I wanted to. But, look at it in here. Look at this. This is almost like home like makeover with a permanent fixture, aka dogs. <laughs> I'm not a fixture. I'm a statue. I'm a statue too.
Phoenix is asleep in his haunted house and uh, we're gonna go to bed too but uh, we're gonna have some popcorn first and we're gonna watch an episode of The Magicians and then we're gonna go to bed it was a good day um, we didn't do any more drawing no, tonight I was tempted to but um... That's okay. I don't really know if I want to set that up right now. Yeah. <laughs> it has to be done at night, so I thought maybe tomorrow night I'll be more ready for it. Yeah. I basically, was. Uh, a lot of stuff was going on today. Angie worked her butt off in cleaning and getting stuff set unpacking up. Unpacking stuff. Yeah, unpacking and yeah. It has, we got a lot to do yet, but we're getting there slowly. Yeah. As new pieces come to the house, everything moves and changes, and you don't know where anything is. <laughs> That happens so often. It's like, honey, where's this at? It's gonna happen again, too. <laughs> See, <laughs> that's one thing. Okay, nothing against you. Because it's fine. <laughs> but when I used to have roommates and I would put stuff in places, it would drive me crazy when I would come home and it would be in different places <laughs> or whatever. But, I mean... That's because that's that your was, personality. Well, okay, yeah. I'm I'm a little OCD. I was an only child too, so I had friends that would come over to my house and they would break my stuff. Not on purpose most of the time, I don't think. But I had like a, a Waylon Jennings uh, Dukes of Hazard LP. Friend broke that. That would have been worth money now. Anyway, it's neither here nor there. Everything's fine now, right? It's actually kind of challenging to come home and try to find things. Once everything's got a home and a place to be, then it it's not like it's going to change all the time then. But for the next little while, it has to because yeah. there's just nowhere to put anything here. So it's like I'm trying to fit, juggling and moving things around. Just I'm trying to, to figure out fit. where it fits, yeah, uh, how it looks, and it's the merging of two households, and it's so amazing. It it's finally starting to feel like our place instead of just Angie staying here. Yeah. So, that's neat. Okay. Enough of this mushy stuff. Happy hunting, guys. See you tomorrow. I'm tired. I want to watch a movie and go, and go to bed. Okay. I think. What was that? I thought that maybe she'd do it for the camera. She's like... <laughs> <laughs> Don't touch me there. Don't. <laughs> I'm not looking at you anymore. You touch me in my places. No, not there. Good night. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Good night, guys.